Welcome to some Hockey Ultimate Team action here on EA Sports. I'm James Savalski, and these are a couple of fun squads. I'm looking forward to this. Really looking forward to this one tonight. We've been waiting all day for this, and it has finally arrived. We're underway here. Montreal's got it behind the net. Here he is, wrestling on that. Fantastic save! Luongo is able to square up to the shooter right here. He's in a dangerous position in the slot area. What a great save, James. And he denied that opportunity. Every coach is going to tell you, get in front of the goaltender and take away their eyes. It's the goaltender's job to find the puck. He finds it and makes the save. Long jam in front, that's broken up. Goaltender covers it up and we'll get a reset here. Lots of time left in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And they'll cover it up, forcing a stoppage in play. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Handles the pass. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. And he was ready for that save. Goaltender covers up. We got a stoppage in play. Still a lot of time left in the period as we approach the midway mark. Still scoreless in this one. The Kings take possession off the faceoff. Dismiss that chance. Ah, he's reading these shooters so well. He's getting in front of them. He's aggressive. And he's challenging them to beat him, James. And that's what I love about him. A ton of confidence. Along the half wall with the puck. Couldn't catch up to that pass. Here's a shot. Oh, you got to love the effort as he blocks that. Matthews moves it into the attacking end. Oh, a spectacular save right there! Wow! Unbelievable! I mean, it was all but in, and he steals it because of that last-ditch attempt to find the puck. Just incredible save, James. The Kings scoop it up along the boards. Looks to get the puck over to Shanahan. Tosses it on to Donchar. Nice feed at center, moves up ahead now. Oh, and he throws a perfectly executed hip check there. Moves the puck to the attacking area. Makes the save with the trapper. Hammers the shot. He scores. What a goal. Wow, this is right off the rush. He's got a ton of speed in motion. It's that quick release that he's known for that beats the goaltender. Well, we see him working on this all the time in practice. His beautiful snapshot is about getting it off quick. It's not necessarily the power hard. It's about having that pinpoint accuracy, and this one is disguised, and it fools the goaltender. The Canadians are up by one after that strike here in the second half of this first period. Well, they're in good shape here right now, James, because they've started it strong, they've competed for every puck, and now they find themselves with the lead. Now it's about holding it, being consistent, and finding a way to reach for more. There he is from the slot! Oh, he just got enough of that to keep it out! Montreal's got the lead here in the first as they have been the more dominant team in the offensive area. And they'll start with possession. No room for that one to get through. Takes it into the slot. Oh, stick save and a butte. Love the way the goaltender gets tight to the shooter. He scores! Leon cross it up. had a chance on this one. I mean, such a quick release shot. It was like a flick of the wrist, disguised the shot, and it was in the back of the net. Montreal has extended the lead to two goals here in the first. Now you can certainly see that they've jumped to their step. They have their legs underneath them, and they've really dictated pace and controlled the game. Moves it quickly over to Dreisaitl. Montreal's got it from behind the net. And the goaltender comes up 
what a piece of it to keep it out of the net. No, sir! Takes the puck behind the net. Oh, my goodness! He is on fire right now! He's out battling his opponent right now. He is so dialed in. He's tracking the puck, making save after save. It's about time his team starts working in front of him. Well past the midway mark of this period. Montreal's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Big save in front. And we'll get the whistle after the goaltender hangs on. And both centers glide into the dot as a face-off set to resume. The Kings win the draw here in their own end. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. The Kings have it now. Gardner's gained the line and on the attack. And he slides it quickly to Robitaille. The Canadians have it against the wall. Steps inside the attacking zone down the left wing. Oh, puts it wide and big time. Big time save. Oh, my goodness. Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. The Kings will play it in their own end. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Moves it to McCarr. Takes a shot. Oh, fantastic stop there. There's the whistle. We'll get a face off after the goalie covers up. Here in the late goings of the period, and it's a comfortable 2 nothing lead we're looking at right now. Lemieux run the draw there on the attack. On the backhand! Way too much congestion blocks that. And that would stop. Winding down the final minute of this opening frame. Montreal's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Takes a shot. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. Oh, they do it again! And he hangs on just as time runs out. There's the buzzer. 20 minutes in the books. Second period just around the corner. in this one. How do you sum up the performance? The Kings are going to need to find the details in their game here, James. They're not winning face-offs. They're not starting with the puck. And it's a real reason why they're behind. Cuts into the pad. Scores! They strike again and it's three unanswered goals. Over and over and over again, James. And you can see the excitement on the bench. They know that they've deflated and they've pushed their opponent back on their heels. They need to keep plugging away here and not get complacent. The Canadians make it a 3-0 game here in period number two. Well, it's still in the second period, James, so there's still a lot of one-way left, but if they can continue to stay consistent and play this way, it's going to be tough for their opponent to get back in. They're pitching the shutout right now, and for a reason. They've been tight defensively as well. And that doesn't reach the net. The Kings gain the zone. Still has possession. Picks it off. They go back on the attack. The Kings looking against the half wall. The Canadians gain possession. Here's an odd man rush. Puck picked up by McDavid. Played big in the moment there. The Kings move the puck in the defensive zone. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Montreal's got control of it now from their own end. With possession along the wall. Scores! And that's four a row, and they are rolling tonight. Well, the whole bench is rolling. Why? Because they're all getting goals and apples. And the stats tonight. You can feel the energy as they're all standing up. They've got four in a row. Montreal's 
got to be pleased with the effort they've had tonight. They just continue to pile up the goals. So you want to buy in, and the coach will be impressed by this. You buy in defensively, and it creates offense because you're quick to get pucks and go north. And this is exactly how you take care of your own zone. How about the majority of shots in the offensive zone as well? 200 foot game. It's been complete today so far, James. To the low slot. And the traffic neutralizes that threat. The Canadians take possession here in the open ice. Picked up along the boards by Matthews. Hammers one. Oh, he got a piece of it to keep it out. Deep inside his own end, right in front. Can he get out of pressure? The Kings will play it from the defensive zone. Sends it across the ice. Moves the puck along the half wall. Can hang on to the puck after taking a knock. Nylander's got it deep in the offensive end. Puck scooped up by Thompson. He was totally locked in on that play. The Kings have it now. Oh, what a hip check of the old school variety. Beautiful. From behind his own cage, he grabs the puck. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. Here he is in close. What a stick save at point blank range by Bobrovsky. Shooters work so hard in practice in getting the wrister off fast and hard, James. And this goaltender, he gets across quick and makes the stop. And the puck departs the zone. Solid check to slow him down. St. Louis got the puck in his own zone. Into the offensive end now. Thunderous hip check on the play. Dobson's picking up steam. Gaining steam here on the attack. Oh, Waffle boards it to keep it out. Rips it and rips it. And that goes off a player. Moves behind the net. Let's it go. Stars. They came. They saw. They took advantage of the rebound and score. That's what you call taking advantage of a fortuitous rebound, and you have to be able to smell it and skip it out because he has great hand-eye coordination. Be able to pick that one up and put it in the back of the net. Montreal's having a night as, as some kids might say, Cheryl. They're balling out there here in period number two. Just loving it out here, James. I mean, they have had control of the play. They've been so dominant. It almost feels effortless. And when it feels effortless, you don't want it to stop. And they've got an intermission looming, and you know they want to stay on the ice. The Canadians will take it behind the net. Gardner's lugging the puck. The Kings are across the line and into the offensive end. Takes that pass back at the point. Big time stop by Bobrovsky. Oh, he's such an offensive producer, and he just doesn't get it this time. And typically when he does, the whole team gets on his back and rides along with him. Oh, turns it aside once again. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Montreal's had no shortage of scoring opportunities tonight, and they have capitalized on plenty as they take a sizable lead here late in the second. Gretzky's won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Luongo's going to give everyone a chance to breathe and hang on to the puck. Montreal's been putting lots of pucks on net all night long, and they lead it here late in the second. Offense is on faceoff, and he wins the draw. The shooter's gonna run out of real estate because he... Here he is all alone, right in the open ice! All right, we've played now 40 minutes in this one and still a critical 20 minutes still needs to be played. Go stretch your legs, grab that final snack because the third period is just around the corner.
Curious to see if there was any message sent in the room in that second intermission because it has been a blowout thus far. I wonder if they might even just run the clock. Well, Pounder, we've played more than 40 minutes now on this one. How do you view things? The Kings are right where they should be in this game, James, and that is behind entering the third period. Why? They just haven't had the puck. It hasn't been on their stick, which means they haven't been able to generate anything offensively. Turned aside by Luongo. Inside his own end, moves the puck. Montreal's gained possession. Passes up ahead for the left wing. Quick pass over to Gartner. Broken up by Kucherov. Takes the puck at the point. Picks up the puck. Montreal's regained possession of the puck. Look at this. Oh, what a save on the play! Well, James, I think he might have gotten in too tight here when he was selling the fake, but a nice save by the goal team. Score! Zone. Turned aside with the glove by Miller. 
There's the whistle as the goalie hangs on. The Canadians don't want to take their foot off the gas here in the third period, but they have a lot of padding with the lead that they've built. McDavid's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. The Canadians continue to lead here in this third period. They've been the busier team offensively. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Drives to the sweet spot! Denies him! Miller's really struggled tonight, and the team in front of him as well. They've got to find a way to get back on track. They need to switch the momentum of this game if they want to get back in it. Montreal's got the puck along the wall. have been extremely strong defensively tonight. They protected the interior of the ice. They pushed everything to the perimeter and now they're protecting the shutout. Now a quick pass to Gartner. And it's poked away in the neutral zone. Nice heads up play there. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Quick pass to Robotov. Shuts him down. The Kings pick up the puck here in the neutral zone. And that's knocked away. Slides it diagonally to Gretzky. Unable to reach that one. We're gonna face it off after the puck stays covered up. Montreal's had a lot of success tonight. Other scoring chances, and look at the result here late in this third period. The Canadians win the face off. Oh, he made the save! How did he stop it? I have no idea, James. I mean, he was down and out, but for Well, and it's deserved right now. I mean, he was excellent 
tonight, and the puck was like a beach ball. He saw absolutely everything, and he was in perfect position all night long. This has really become one of the real premier party destinations in the hockey landscape, and here's a reason why. Look at this celebration here, Cheryl. And you gotta love this. I mean, the fans are there for you while you're playing the game, and you come back out to say thank you to them. Well, we certainly had a great time tonight, everybody in the broadcast crew as well, and from all of us here at EA Sports, I'm James Cebulski wishing you a safe and healthy night, and we'll see you down the road again soon.